Morning! We are at the Garden of Gethsemane and here is um, the temple that we just went inside and over there is the oldest olive tree here. So right now we're heading into the um, old city, it's called the Lion's Gate, it's one of the eight gates and this is in the Muslim Quarter. This is the Muslim Quarter. We went up and we went through Lion's Gate and we just went inside here. It smells so good. <laughs> So crazy in this place. We are at the door where um, Jesus carried his cross and leaned against the wall. And there's all these different like religious groups around here, and people singing, and it's so busy. People are carrying like the cross. This is the place we want. That's Nuts. 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 Hmm. That is so nice. And it's good, the back of the heat isn't too sweet. Like it's sweet, but it's not like, oh my gosh. Crazy sweet. Okay, so this place behind me is very, very special. It's called the Wailing Wall. And everyone from all different cultures come here to put little prayers into the wall. And this day is actually, like, not a coincidence, I think. We are here on Holocaust Day, and they just played the siren. Western Wall, um, and now we're gonna walk. We're walking through the old city markets. It's so fun, but we, a guy keeps walking and we just want to stop. Anyways, I'm gonna say the um, the Western Wall, also known as the Wailing Wall, was actually really emotional. Yeah, like I just felt like where it was saying like there is great faith in this place. Yeah, I just felt that. It's weird, like when you touch the wall, you can feel like it's not just to be there. Like there are so many people like before you that came, like, even like years and years before. Yeah. Like, Well, we've only met nice people, I guess. <laughs> Gal says people aren't very nice down there in the market. Yeah. But um, they just want your money. Yeah. Oh my goodness, I didn't tell you, but at the place we went to yesterday, this guy was trying to give, like this guy dressed in like Jewish stuff, he was trying to give Lizzie uh, like a, just a red thread. Anyways, the guys before us in our group, they like tackled them, so they gave them 50 bucks. Yeah, so we got away. Lucky. Anyways, look how pretty. We're going to lunch now in the old city.
right? Okay, yeah, we're at the Reserve Museum. <laughs> I was going to go around. And um, this yeah. is apparently what um, the city would have looked like in year 70. So today we went into here's Lionsgate. Yeah. And then we walked, walked down. We went in here. And then we somehow went across all the way to the Western Wall, which is where we prayed. pretty much over and now we are out exploring <laughs> we want to go back to the old city because there's like markets and stuff there and and baklava. and the baklava and so we're trying to find it we just got off opposite this big shopping center it's kind of like Westfield and so yeah how cool is this we're walking next to this massive wall and now we're just trying to find one of the eight gates to enter in to the old city before it closes because it closes at dark we're going in here. All right, we found the place that we need to be. <laughs> She's happy. <laughs> We're such good tourists. We find places. Yeah. Maybe a, a cardboard box or one of those boxes. Get the cardboard one. Yeah. Yeah. Thirty. Awesome. Thanks. So for all of this, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10 things we paid 30 shekels, which is like less than 10 US dollars. Pretty good. Yeah. This is amazing. It's like nuts and dates in the croissant. And this one is a cinnamon and nut baklava. Now we take a picture. Oh, thank you. <laughs> awesome. That looks great. It smells divine. I love it. Thanks so much. So we were just we just went to the um, Old Jerusalem. Old Jerusalem and went through in through Jaffa Gate and we found the sky in the in this carpet shop. In the Muslim quarters, actually. There's like Muslim and then Christian, the Christian in between there. Yeah. And we were just like randomly walking, and I was like, oh, carpet, because I wanted to get a carpet. Anyways, it was like just looking at the shop, and then we ended up talking to the shop owner. His name was Ahmed, right? Abed. Abed. Um, anyways, it was awesome. We ended up sitting there for like an hour, just had, and he made coffee for us in his shop. It was good times. Okay, we are at Joshua's, Joshua's Cafe. It's got a wine. And we just got this tuna.